I, I got in trouble with my roommate because uh, one of the roommates moved out and the other one was a girl. She was like, Seton, I had this idea. We need a clean roommate. I was like, okay, yes, we do. Fine. Well, there's two people available. One's this regular dude. Another one's a gay dude. I say, let's go for the gay dude because he'll be cleaner. And I was like, open-minded. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. But in retrospect, that's, a, that's stupid, right? To believe just because you're gay, you're clean? That's not... That's not true at all. I'll tell you for a fact. It's not true at all. He was the dirtiest human being I've ever lived in my life. Like, over, overwhelmingly, like, like, there was so much dick here on the toilet, I thought he was hurting himself. You know what I mean? Like, I did. I thought he was just going in there like, ah! That makes sense? That happened to you? That happened to you, baby? It don't make no sense. Because here's the thing, you know what it is? You know, you know how we messed up? Because we were trying to be so open-minded. We were like, gay guy, let's get a gay guy. But you know what? We didn't want a gay guy, man. We wanted a gay guy, you know what I mean? You know? We wanted like a really musical gay, right? But we ended up getting like a meat and potatoes gay. Does that make sense? Like, he was just a regular dude who just happened to like dick. Does that make sense? Like. He loved beer, he loved video games, and he loved dick. You know what I mean? He'd be like, mm, yeah, oh, video game, oh, like dick. Back to the video game, back to the video game. Wait, wait, pause game, pause game. Back to the game, back to the game, back to the game. Where's my beer? It's a regular dude, you know what I mean, yo? Living life.